welcome to my morning. This particular day, my husband had to travel out of state. So I stayed the night at my in-law's house actually, so they could watch my kids while I worked a full 12 hour shift. I have to leave for work around 6 a.m. to get there at 7, so it just makes more sense to let my kids sleep at my in-law's house instead of waking them up super early, putting them in the car, and getting them out the door. I've only been back to work for a few weeks now, so on those days this pump literally rules my life. This particular morning, Peyton woke up before my alarm, so I fed her around 4.45 a.m. The amount of milk I pump in the morning, I leave out for Peyton for when she wakes up again, and then the rest of the day she just gets milk from my stash in the freezer. This morning I only got about one ounce out of the side that I had just fed her on, and about three ounces out of the other side. If she sleeps longer in the night, I can get as much as eight ounces altogether. Time to head out the door. Okay. We're off. It's 5.54. I wanted to leave at 5.50. It's not too bad. My in-laws live in the middle of nowhere on a dirt road. So there's literally no light out here. Sorry. So yeah, that's my morning. Now I'm off. I have to be out. I have to clock in by seven. I didn't eat breakfast, so I grabbed a banana. I stole a banana. They don't care. I did some makeup. But I usually don't have time. I mean, I've been out since 4.50 and I still didn't have time to do my hair. Just because I had to pump and all that stuff. So I usually do it in the car. Don't judge me. is bringing me one because she's the best. I think I'm going to need a lot of coffee today. Peyton, Levi went to bed pretty good, but Peyton, I mean, she was all right. She just woke up a lot to eat, so I fed her at 11. And she woke up at 2, so I fed her at 2. And then she woke up at 4.45, like right before my alarm went off at 5. So, I'm a little sleepy this morning. I'm gonna try to pump around 9.30. We'll see how busy it is today. That's the kind of thing that stinks about being a nurse and trying to pump at the same time because you can't always pump when you want to. I always try to pump in the morning and then pump during my lunch break and then pump one more time at nighttime before I leave, like around five or six, so three times while I'm at work. And I always pump, obviously, before I leave. And then when I get home, if, so, if the person who has her just fed her, then I'll pump at home, or I'll just feed her when I get home. Um, yeah. So, I'm gonna walk in now. See you at nine, I guess, 9.30. <laughs> or 10. Ha. <laughs> So it's 9.39, I'm gonna pump for like 10 minutes, really quick. I'm really busy this morning, so I only have like a couple minutes. 
this particular day at work was so busy, so I literally just had to get my three pumps in as fast as I could and get right back on my unit. That's uh, nurse life slash mom life right there. Pump, 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 pump. That's all I do. Pump, 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 pump. It's two o'clock. It's been crazy. So I'm, I'm uh, gonna pump right now at two. I just ate lunch real quick because I hadn't eaten all day. Um, I'm gonna pump real quick. Hi, honey. Hi. Okay, I swear Peyton is on the screen, but you hear my father-in-law, but I'm using those really sweet voices towards my daughter. But one thing I do like about pumping at work is it gives me a minute to FaceTime with my kiddos and see how they're doing. Anyway, with the, each pump that I do throughout the day, I usually get about three ounces on each side. I'm super behind today. It's 6.23 and I've gotten sick throughout the day. And my in-laws just called me. And um, Levi has a temperature of 101.6. So, um, I'm gonna just do my last pump real quick. Even though I have to leave in like an hour and then um, hopefully go home and take care of my sick kids because I'm getting sick too. So, um, I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be able to take the rest of my day, but it's 6.30, almost. So, I gotta get my last pump in or else I'm probably gonna explode. <laughs> um, my kids are going to be okay. My husband's flying um, in tonight at midnight, so he's not even here. So I'm at work and my husband's gone and my little boy is sick, so uh, yeah, today kind of sucks. But anyways, gotta do what you want, gotta do, so see ya. So I got back to my in-laws around 8.30 that evening. And I really, really didn't feel good. So I just fed Peyton real quick and got me, her, and Levi to bed right away. So thanks guys so much for watching. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. And we'll see you at my next video.